Hi, I'm Carrie Kirkham and you're Sipping with the Wine Fox. Right now, I'm in San Francisco at the Rotunda at Neiman Marcus enjoying a fantastic glass of champagne that I would like you to know about. It is Louis Roterer Brut Rosé. Louis Roterer is the champagne house that also makes Cristal that everybody knows about, as well as, you know, Roterer Estate, which is based in Philo. So this is uh, Louis Roterer Brut Rosé from Champagne. It's a blend of around 65% Pinot, 35% Chardonnay. 20% of the wine was matured in oak tons. So one thing that was interesting is that this wine was aged on its lees for four years. And what was what's really neat about this is after six months after disgorgement, the wine rests in bottle. So it's disgorged and it rests for six months before it goes to market, perhaps even longer. So that gives the wine a chance to, to develop its beautiful flavor post disgorgement. But four years on the lees, it really comes across in the flavor and the roundness of the wine. Right when the um, server set the glass in front of me, I could smell the aromas coming off the glass of like pastry, like toasty baked pastry. Beautiful, uh, bright raspberry quality, cherry, strawberry, just a melange of, of bright, crisp uh, fruitiness and a hint of like a fresh rose, fresh rose petal. This is a gorgeous wine and a fantastic value. It's in the $60 range, but it is a brilliant value. It's a, a nice light salmon color, which you can see um, there. And if you look at the slow, steady bead of bubbles, you can tell the wine's been on its lees for a while because the CO2 is integrated very well with the wine. This is a wine that you can sit and sniff and sip and contemplate. And I tell you what, it goes fantastic with popover and strawberry butter. Oh my gosh, it's a dream. And to that, I say cheers and carpe uvum.